The steriorum is really a critical part of a dental practice where we have to manage the risk of transmission of infection to the public. And it's critical for dentists and all registered dental practitioners to take that responsibility seriously and make sure that what happens in the steriorum room is best practice. Some common problems that we see in sterilising rooms is the issue with the workflow from the start to finish. So in this sterilising room we've got our contaminated consumables in the midsection of the steri room. So we've got to dispose of consumables here but then cross over back into the contamination zone to then start to package. So it's not ideal. We've then got further along some more issues with bench space problems. So we don't have a clear workspace that's heavily lit so that we can inspect instruments and then have a, have a nice workflow and um, end of a steri process from here. So a common concern is that when you talk to dentists, their focus is always on the dental operatory, which is where they spend all their time. But of course, under our national regulatory approach, the responsibility of a dentist or another dental practitioner extends all the way through the practice to include their sterilising room. And it's important that they know how it works and that they are taking responsibility to make sure it works well. Often when there's an audit done of a practice, the dentist doesn't even know what colour the paint on the wall of the sterilising room is, let alone what the processes are. And by bringing in improved processes and quality systems, we can actually help to address some of those issues. Many of the regulators around the country are now starting to target dental practices for inspections under public health because they realise there is a risk to public when dental sterilising isn't done well. They're most likely struggling with what is the right steri, what is the right design, how to eliminate all the issues of wasting time because as we all know the most important time for a dentist is chargeable time which is normally Mondays to Fridays. So we're here to eliminate all of their concerns and to offer an end-to-end -end solution and that's why we called our new project Total Steri Solutions. Here we've got a solution which is built on the aggregated experience of some people who really know about design. And so a lot of those subtle things about good design of a stereo room have already been thought about and built in. Well, I think the nice thing about this approach is that all of the hard work is actually done after hours once you've been through the initial design on the tablet app. So in technical terms, we are coming on a Friday once the last client um, left your surgery or the client's surgery. We're taking away the old steri, we're putting in new flooring, new electricity, new plumbing. Australia's first custom and um, purpose-built sterilization area, new equipment sophisticated and connected to all the things that are state-of-the-art right now, and out to shipment of consumables, new aircon, new lighting, so it should be after 36 hours a compliant, certified, handovered, new work environment perfectly and according to all Australia's standards. We sort of take the sterilising, which has sort of been back of house and hidden away in a black box, to actually make it a showcase in a practice and something we'd be proud to show our patients all this effort that we go to in order to make their visit safe. So we're not only going to provide you with a new sterilising room and equipment, we're also going to provide you with one-on-one -on -one comprehensive training with the skills and know-how moving forward. We'll do this by delivering training videos and training with one of our representatives in-house. Technically, we are able to support Australia's dentists about 8 to 12 simultaneously installation Australia-wide each and every weekend. Very unique, very good and um, hopefully you'll be one of them.